the players come in with high hopes and high expectations, especially in sports like men's basketball and football, to maybe play in the NBA or the NFL. So you really have to be, I think, a player's coach more now than, say, 50 or 60 years ago. A former Arizona Wildcat speaks out about the search for a new head football coach. Welcome back, everyone. Since Kevin Sumlin was fired last weekend after leading the Wildcats to its first winless season in program history, U of A Athletics has been on the hunt for his potential successor. News 11 Sports caught up with AWC men's head soccer coach Kenny Dale, who also happens to be a Wildcat alum, to get his take on someone's firing and the search for his replacement. Although he believes someone should have gotten another year to turn the program around, Dale understands the reasoning behind the decision, especially the Cats' poor showing in the latest Territorial Cup game. As far as any potential replacement is concerned, Dale gives us what he he believes are the two most important criteria for the next head coach to have in order to get this job. The U of A has produced a lot of professional football players that have played long careers in the NFL. So I think uh, an alumni of the University of Arizona, maybe who is currently coaching in the college ranks or the NFL, uh, would be great because they understand Tucson and they understand the fan atmosphere and what's important to people in, in Tucson uh, and supporting the Wildcats. When asked who he would pick as the next Wildcats head coach without hesitation, he blurted out the popular name, Teddy Bruschi. We can know in a matter of days what the U of A chooses to do.